We begin with a story we broke first on WPRI.com. A Cranston police investigation determines a now suspended police chief challenged the Cranston officer to a fight during a May police ceremony. The confrontation was caught on video and according to the police report, the North Providence officer mounted expletives at the other officer as he sat in the crowd during the otherwise solemn ceremony. Target 12 investigator Walt Buteau first broke this last month and was also first to report these new details. He's here now with more. According to the investigation, the roots of this caught on video altercation date back about 20 years and involve a woman who the Cranston police officer eventually married. The unnamed Cranston police officer was part of the honor guard during the May 18th Police Week memorial service in front of the Cranston police station. The 33-page report on what followed indicates now suspended North Providence Police Chief Christopher Palagio mouthed expletives at the Cranston officer from the crowd. Then after the ceremony was over, Palagio, in the white shirt on the right, walks toward the Cranston officer, who along with several witnesses told investigators Palagio challenged him to a fight. The Cranston officer said Bellagio was yelling, come on, tough guy, make a move, hit me, come on, and also said he would meet him at his gym anytime. Another witness told investigators Pelagio claimed he was threatened, saying one of your guys, referring to the Cranston officer, wants to fight me in front of the police station. He's going to rip my arms off. But Cranston Police Chief Colonel Michael Winquist said the investigation concluded Pelagio was the aggressor and his officer did nothing wrong. Pelagio, who claimed there was a chest bump, initially told police Police, he was going to press charges, but the investigation cited the video, stating there is no evidence of any physicality in the altercation, and Pelagio never pressed charges. Pelagio, who is currently suspended with pay from his job as interim chief in North Providence, has not returned requests for comment from Target 12. Also, no comment from North Providence Mayor Charles Lombardi. Tonight at 6, the details behind what witnesses say is behind this confrontation. With the Target 12 investigators, Walt Buteau. Eyewitness News. The Target 12 investigators are always looking to uncover news. If you want to send a tip or report government wasting, call our tip line 228-1763 or email us at target12 at wdpri.com. First at 6, the Target 12 investigators with a story we broke first on WPRI.com. Princeton police investigators determined the now suspended police chief of North Providence was the aggressor in a confrontation during a May police ceremony honoring fallen officers. As we first showed you live at 5, the incident was all caught on surveillance video. According to the report, suspended chief Christopher Palagio challenged a Cranston police officer to a fight. Target 12 investigator Walt Buteau first broke this last month and joins us now live with the details behind the altercation that dates back two decades. The 33-page report states the altercation started with mouthed expletives from the crowd and ended with two officers face-to-face. After the ceremony was over, now suspended North Providence Police Chief Christopher Palagio is seen in a white shirt walking from the area with the chairs toward a group of Cranston police officers. The Cranston officer said Palagio was yelling, come on, tough guy, make a move, hit me, come on, and also said he would meet him at his gym anytime. Another witness told investigators Palagio claimed he was threatened, saying one of your guys, referring to the Cranston officer, wants to fight me in front of the police station. He's going to rip my arms off. But Cranston Police Chief Colonel Michael Winquist said the investigation concluded Palagio was the aggressor and his officer did nothing wrong. Palagio, who claimed there was a chest bump, initially told police he was going to press charges, but the investigation cited the video, stating there is no evidence of any physicality in the altercation and Palagio never pressed charges. According to the Cranston officer who was part of the ceremony honor guard, the tension dates back about 20 years when he began dating and eventually married Palagio's ex-girlfriend. The Cranston officer also told investigators the two had been involved in other altercations and he claims Palagio tried to prevent him from getting a job as a police officer and played a role in limiting his future career options. No one will be charged in connection with this altercation. Palagio has not returned requests for comment. North Providence Mayor Charles Lombardi, Lombardi told us he could not comment on what is still an active investigation in his town. With the Target 12 investigators, Walt Buteau, Eyewitness News. The Target 12 investigators are always looking to uncover news. If you want to send a tip or report government waste, you can call our tip line at 228-1763 or email us at target12 at wpri.com.